Hello everyone, welcome back to Moby Zone. Today, Samsung's semiconductor division has introduced a specialized type of RAM tailored for mobile artificial intelligence and gaming applications. They've named it LLWD RAM, an abbreviation for low latency white EO, indicating wide band input output with low latency. Samsung initially revealed the LLWD RAM back in January during Tech Day, revisiting the topic briefly in October at Memory Tech Day. During this event, they presented solutions such as HBM3 e Shine Bolt and LPDDR5X Cam 2. Recently, Samsung reminded everyone about their LLWD chip through a Twitter video. The 44-second teaser showcases the LLWD RAM positioned alongside the processor on the chip, aligning with the claimed low latency. However, the video suggests that LLW chips will complement the processor rather than entirely replace traditional RAM. The precise timeline for incorporating LLW into Samsung chipsets remains unclear. However, there's speculation that the Galaxy S24 series might be the first smartphones to incorporate this technology. Samsung is already gearing up for its next flagship, introducing new artificial intelligence features like AI Life Translate Call, set to be available early next year. There's speculation that the Galaxy S24 might be labeled as the first AI phone, potentially serving as the launch platform for LLWRAM. Contrary to earlier rumors about Samsung upgrading RAM in its flagship devices, a new rumor contradicts these claims. According to Ice Universe, the base Galaxy S24 will have only 8GB of RAM without the option to upgrade to higher capacities. The Galaxy S24 Plus will offer a 12GB RAM option, while its base version will still use 8GB of RAM. Additionally, rumors suggest that the Galaxy S24 Ultra will maintain 8GB of RAM in the base model and 12GB of RAM in the higher spec model, similar to the S23 Ultra. If this information holds true, it raises concerns for Samsung in 2024. There's a possibility that even iPhones might outpace Samsung in terms of RAM. I didn't recommend the S23 Ultra with 8GB of RAM, suggesting it's better to pay more for 12GB. As for the S24 Ultra, promising a feature-rich AI experience, if this information is accurate, it doesn't bode well for Samsung. Consumers might be disappointed that Samsung is falling behind in specifications, not offering more RAM in its flagship smartphone lineup for the fourth consecutive year. However, perhaps the LLW chip we discussed earlier will compensate for the difference and provide a boost for quick artificial intelligence operations. Time will tell. In any case, we'll keep you informed. Thanks for tuning in, and stay tuned for the next video.